Grodd's a fan favorite. He's certainly a fan favorite from the comic books. Grodd hate banana. When we started doing a Flash TV show, people probably thought, well, they'll have Captain Cold and the Mirror Master and, you know, uh, uh, a few other rogues, but they'll never be able to do Grodd. Not only have we done Grodd, but now we're going to Gorilla City and we're meeting Solovar and seeing an army of gorillas. And it's a massive episode for us. And Armin Kevorkian and everyone at Encore who do our visual effects were ready for the challenge and excited. I'm going back to Earth too. So episode 13 is Attack on Gorilla City. We had to build a detailed version of Gorilla City because you wanted that beautiful fly through to it, you know, and see, you know, what it's all about with the structures, the statues. And then we had to build different kinds of gorillas to kind of populate the city with. So we did that, and you know, there's a few generic gorillas that we built, so you know, all of them don't look alike. Armin and his team did a, uh, 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 an early uh, animatic of uh, Barry facing a gorilla in a giant gladiator ring. Of course, we thought that's amazing. Truth be told, we hadn't even really thought of that as part of the story, and when Armin showed us that, we're like, oh, I guess we have to have uh, Flash fight a giant gorilla in a... Coliseum full of gorillas. So we actually incorporated that into the storyline. Obviously, we're going to need a Coliseum that would hold up up close because, you know, the end of season two, you just saw it really far away. This is all CG. We have to add hundreds of gorillas in the stadium stand. So, you know, that's crowd software. How is it going to react? You have to do like animation cycles of them cheering, you know, and get that right to kind of populate it. There's different kinds of cheers you have to do. It's really kind of mimicking a real gladiator fight that would take place in the Coliseum and bringing that to life, but everything is done virtually. It might be the greatest thing I've ever seen on television. After you die, your friends will follow you into the black. We'll see. Salvar is from the comics. He's the white gorilla. He's like the leader of Gorilla City. We made him a little bit older looking, so it felt like he was wise and that it would be more believable that he was a leader. There's an albino gorilla out there that we did reference as far as like the wrinkles and the eyes and how all that would work. Any sign of him yet? Not since you asked 30 seconds ago. Okay, he's a giant gorilla who's probably leading an army of giant gorillas. How can you not find him? 314 is called Attack on Central City. So our team managed to make it home, but uh, they bring a large army of gorillas on their tail. Like I told Flash, always think ahead. Now you will open the breaches, and very soon, Central City will fall before Grodd. Yeah, we had to design their armor. We had to kind of come up with, like, what does it look like with gorillas, you know, that are ready for war? And the more they did, the more they inspired us to push it further and further. And even we can't believe what we were able to pull off. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to our channel to watch behind the scenes video and more from The Flash.